Hi guys, I'm back with another video here, and uh, I just got done watching John Wick, so I thought I would give you guys my basic thoughts on it, you know, just, just try to describe how I felt about the movie, and overall, I pretty much liked it, you know, it's a pretty good movie. Um, you know, it picks up about relatively soon after three, I don't know how much time has passed, probably like a month, I guess, or so. Anyway, it picks up at the you know, uh, John training in a basement or a sewer or somewhere, somewhere in there. And, you know, after Winston shot him off a roof at the end of the last one, you know, kind of left him wondering, well, how's he going to come back from that? You know, of course, it's John Wick. He always comes back. More on that later. Um, but, yeah, I thought this movie was really good. Uh, of course, the plot follows. Uh, he has to... Basically, it's the final ride, you know. Uh, he, he has to try to clear his name from excommunicado from the high table, you know, once and for all, try to end this. You know, and uh, I really liked Bill Sarsgaard's character as the villain. Um, I really liked Donnie Yen's character. Um, yeah, so I don't know how much more I can go into that. Without giving away major, major spoilers. I mean, most of you have probably already seen it by now, so it doesn't really matter, but, uh... Anyway, um... Yeah, and so then... I guess the movie kind of goes into... Later on in the movie, there's this really cool scene where I thought it was pretty cool. It's... He's, John looks going through a house... And uh, he's got this kind of incendiary rounds, I guess, you know, rounds where it lights on fire and stuff. And uh, they're filming, they use this really cool filming angle, I thought, which was they were filming from the top, or you can see down, you know. And so we were staring, looking at John Wick, but it was at the top of his head, you know, and filming. It was like it was looking down from the ceiling. And he was just blasting through people, through the house. You know, it looked like he was just blasting people, lighting them on fire. So, yeah. That was a pretty cool scene. It reminded me of, like, you know, Red Dead a little bit. The kind of ammo you can craft and all that. My days playing that game. Um, but, yeah. Um, I guess I'll go ahead and do the ending. You know, you guys probably know already know. But, you know, of course, John dies at the end. I mean, killed by not again in the final duel both him and Donnie Yen are set free Donnie Yen gets his daughter back and gets his freedom from the high table same with John Wick you know you know multiple characters mentioned throughout this movie that you know the only way John Wick would have peace was a death you know and that's unfortunately the way it seems um yeah Winston you know, as part of the deal, um, Winston got to, you know, run the hotel again, Continental Hotel, and, uh, Bill Sarsgaard's character ends up dead, his John Wick actually doesn't fire at the final time, ends up shooting him in the head, which is pretty cool. Um, so yeah, I heard they're making a John Wick 5, but I'm not really sure they're gonna do that, I mean... And it seemed pretty definite to me, but I mean, I'm sure they'll find a way to bring them back, just like in Batman v Superman was Henry Cavill. You know, I thought the same thing then as I'm thinking now, so anyway, I guess I'll just, this is just my basic thoughts on the movie, and you know, overall, I'll give that up. 9 out of 10, somewhere in there. It's pretty good, pretty good. Uh, I think my overall ranking of the John Wick films, I think two's probably my favorite. I know a lot of people don't like two. I think two's really good. Uh, probably one next. No, probably four after that. Two, four, probably one, and then three is probably my least favorite. I think three is probably a lot of people's least favorite in the franchise. Um, but yeah, um, so overall, a pretty good movie. And uh, if you guys might mind liking, hit that like button and subscribe. I 
Surely appreciate it. And, uh, see you guys later. I'm out.